Hey everybody, it's Dave Berman from DaveBermanCoaching.com and the Daily Laughers Facebook group and YouTube channel. This is a Laughter Gym After Report. We just finished our 15 minutes of laughing and our group conversation today, which I'm so excited about really because what I asked everybody was, uh, you know, the same question I always do. What are you noticing? Uh, what came to your attention during your laughter today in our session or recently, you know, between sessions? What are the ripple effects that are showing up in your life? And one of the people started to share a story about, well, she started and finished <laughs> sharing a story about waking up and, you know, just noticing how she kind of had a lot of things on her mind that today wasn't going to be such a good day. And then she just quickly realized that it was just thinking that was creating that feeling of not really looking forward to the day and she kind of chuckled at that and realized she had the laughter gym to look forward to in a short little while and it brought her awareness into the present moment she said much more aware of the now she felt a lot better just by noticing the nature of thought creating her perception in that moment and I was listening to her tell this story and I'm wondering, is she going to say anything about laughter? And after she told us all that, she said, and I think it's laughter that's responsible for all of this. <laughs> and I said, oh, well, you know, I'm, I'm glad that you brought it back to laughter in some way. Um, I wonder when you shared this story or any other observation about how laughter is kind of raising your awareness about the nature of thought. You know, do you, do you always bring it back to laughter? Do we always have to bring it back to laughter? I shared my own story of just two days ago creating a profile on a new community website and being aware that I was not writing for the general public and I was not writing for people who are my potential clients. And that the audience I was writing for, of course, was informing how I was writing what I was writing, which was about how I use laughter to help people become more aware of the nature of thought, creating our experience in every new now. And so back in the laughter gym just now, another one of our members shared how they are bringing laughter into their um, their, their spiritual center where they laugh with the community and they too are raising awareness about thought and that's part of their spiritual practice and that for this other member of our laughter gym group the conversations that we're having that are more and more getting to this nature of thought the impact of noticing without necessarily responding or reacting, but understanding and accepting what is without trying to change what we're thinking or what we're feeling and without looking to techniques for our laughter or for you know, changing our experience. Uh, that this is all totally relevant in his spiritual center and that our division of time in laughter gym between our 15 minutes of laughing and then our group discussion that they're both valuable to him and so this was really great feedback for me to know that what we're creating in the principles of laughter program which you have to be part of to get access to our laughter gym sessions that this really is what's attracting people to participate that it's not just me being all excited about something and, and you know like pulling people along getting people to to do this and uh finding out what people are discovering in their experience and how they're able to share it and how our sharing evolves the more clearly we see what laughter is revealing to us what it's pointing to about the nature of thought uh, and how Deepening our understanding of this is impacting us in ways that are so positive and so powerful. So this is why I come on and do these after reports is to, to give a little kind of anonymous glimpse into what's being shared there and how this is 
creating such a, a, a wonderful set of ripple effects outward. I'd love to have you join us too. Look in the description for this video or the comments below for how to access the Principles of Laughter program and then join us in the Laughter Gym. And I'll see you in another video real soon. Thanks.